What's new in Stop 6? Well, residents are seeing results of an initiative to make Stop 6 a cleaner, safer community. The city of Fort Worth and its contractors have been cleaning up debris and tearing down dilapidated abandoned property since January. And just look at the difference. Before and after cleaning up 86 miles of curbs to make the neighborhood more walkable. Before and after removing dead trees that threaten power lines and people just walking in the vicinity. In all, the city has removed 266 dead, hazardous, or nuisance trees from city property, including 31 miles of right-of-way. Before, during, and after cutting back brush for visibility and collecting 180 tons of litter and trash hidden by overgrown bushes. It's all part of the City Council's new Neighborhood Improvement Strategy. The city is spending more than $2.5 million in the Cabo Place Stop 6 area, after taking a bus tour and hosting six community meetings, council members and staff learned which projects and problems residents wanted handled the most. Things like streetlights to make the neighborhood safer at night. The city is installing more than 100 new lights along Stall Cup and Ramey, with more to come on other streets like Amanda. Residents also asked for sidewalks and curb ramps to make it easier for children to walk to school and residents of all ages and abilities to get around the neighborhood. 77 ramps and 7,500 linear feet of new sidewalks are going in with about 25% completed already. Residents also want to reduce crime. The city will install these new mobile surveillance cameras to help police keep a 24 seven eye on known hotspots of criminal activity. Before, Vacant properties attracted vagrants or worse. The city purchased about 50 buildings like this one. We are cleaning them up and putting them back on the market, enhancing a sense of neighborhood, we hope. Buildings that have not sold yet are being boarded up for safety, but we're not using the old plywood. The city now uses a durable, clear plastic that looks more like someone is living there. A few houses that are just too far gone are being demolished. Crews haul away debris and get empty lots ready for redevelopment. This is one of 84 properties Fort Worth Housing Solutions has purchased for new single family homes. Two east side parks are getting a facelift. Martin Luther King Jr. Community Recreation Center has a fresh coat of paint, more security lighting, and a new parking lot. Rosedale Plaza Park has a brand new concrete loop trail for walkers. Crews have removed old playground equipment and will replace it with new play structures as soon as there is a break in the weather. New park benches and picnic tables are coming as well. But that's not all. Solid waste crews are cleaning illegal dump sites and checking back to see that they don't return. And animal control officers patrol twice a week for stray animals. Residents in Stop 6 tell us they are seeing progress, but we tell them there is so much more to come. Get regular updates on the Stop 6 Neighborhood Improvement Strategy at fortworthtexas.gov slash stop6.